everybody, it's Steve Saw and I'm in my Buick Century! A dream car! Don't you wish you had this beautiful car? <laughs> Something very bad happened. The brakes aren't working. And that's dangerous because if you can't stop, you're probably going to crash. So I have to take my car in and I got to get it fixed. Now here's the problem. Now my Buick Century is from the year 2000. It's old, because, uh, what are we in, 2017, 17 years? Yeah, it's an old car. The only thing is, nothing's wrong with it, as far as the engine goes, but if the brake repair cost is expensive, I think I might have to get a new car. I don't want to, but let's be honest here. If there's a big expense to fix something on a car that's not worth anything, why spend a lot of money on something that's worth nothing? That's the argument. <laughs> now, there are some other problems with my car besides the brakes. Just a few. Let's see, the steering wheel was peeling off, so I had to get like a black cover around the steering wheel. The center console like broke the snap so the center console is flies open so I had to duct tape that shut. The rear view mirror fell off. I had to reattach it but when I reattached it for some reason the mirror itself got all wavy and wiggly. It's, it just doesn't look good. It's hard to look out the rear view mirror. The heat doesn't work in my car unless you turn it on full blast and then when you do turn it on full blast it like hums like brrr. pretty soon it's gonna go out in the summer the only way to get cooler is to put down the window but the driver's side window jams sometimes so that doesn't go down oh it's rusting out on the bottom it hasn't rusted out all the way yet it's not really safe to transport kids in because the seat belts are like it only fits two and I want three kids to be able to ride in it. The gas flap doesn't stay shut. The license plate on the front fell off. Yeah, that might be a problem too. I don't even know if that's legal. So yeah, it's got some problems, but I don't want it to break. I've had this baby forever. I bought this car for only $5,000 when it had 30,000 miles because the old lady that used to own it ran into a basketball pool. So I got a deal for this car. I don't want to buy a new car yet. Now in honor of my love for my car and because this car might not make it anymore, I wrote a song for my Buick Century. If you'll humor me, you can listen to this beautiful song. I love you, Buick Century. You've taken me so far. But now your brakes are broken. Brakes broken. So I might have to get a new car. All right. Give me a number one, because this car is number one. When you put up the number one, that means you'll push out like things like you're getting notified and subscribe and like and comment and do all that stuff and yeah!